I'm on Reddit right now and Reddit's having a meltdown. But the thing is that sometimes Reddit, you get some good stuff, right? Sometimes Reddit, you get some good stuff right over here. It says, check on your Democratic friends because a lot of them are not taking this well. And I don't just mean text them. Actually go to your wife's boyfriend's house and see how they're doing. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. You love to see it, boys. You love to see it, man. This is so funny. I have another one right over here. I have another one right over here. Hi, I was about to text you actually. Hey, what's up? So I think it's best to let you know that with everything going on, I'm putting everything on pause. I don't want to speak to you or any male for that matter romantically anymore. 4B movement. Literally for my safety and <laughs> the best option right now, I'm not even quite sure if I want to remain friends, but we can still keep contact. These, these guys are, oh man, they're, they're freaking wilding out, dude, dude this, this, this is, to be honest, I think this is better than 2016. I, I, I think this is actually better than 2016. And here's why. It's because they won and they think that they are going to win again, right? So like, because they won in uh in they won in uh what's it called again in 2020 and they thought that they were going to win again it's like oh it's going to be in the bag right it's like you know it's kamala harris it's like everyone everyone voted for her because you know they voted for you know joe biden which is not actually true right they thought they was in the bag so this thing's even more oh <laughs> and you love to see it man I didn't want to just ghost you without explanation. Sorry, it ends this way. But I don't want to talk to you or anybody until this shit is fixed. Because as a black woman, this world is already so against me. And I cannot handle this shit right now. I don't know when or if I'll ever feel okay. My energy is gone. I'm just done. I hope you will understand. Man, I wonder if this, if this chick is a fat girl. Why you got to be sharing your DMs? What? I'm going to unmod you right now. I'm, I'm going to unmod you right now. But yeah, this, this is crazy, man. People are getting crazy. Watch. Here's another one right here. Here, here it is. I'm going to watch this one with you guys, okay? Let's watch, let's watch this together. This is a four-minute clip. Let's watch this together. What? What is she saying? What is this bitch saying? Shut the fuck up, pussy! Oh my god, you can't even hear shit! Donald Trump, I hate you. <laughs> you will never be president. <laughs> you don't get that they voted for someone who's gonna make my friends' lives hell. My okay. White privilege right there. White fat privilege. I'm okay because I'm a white fat bitch. Man. The, the thing is that it's just, it's going to get, it's, we're going to get so much of this. This is, co this is content gold right here, man. This, I, I've struck, we've struck oil. Donald Trump is the only person that the left freaks out about, right? Like it's it's like anything that has to do with his cabinet. Everything anything that has to do with his campaign. This is crazy. All my friends are black and queer. I can't believe Trump's actually gonna win this fucking thing. Oh Jesus Christ, I'm so pissed off. No! No! We got Hulk Hogan. They got Wish.com Hulk Hogan. Oh, God damn it! I can't believe Trump's actually gonna win this. Why are, you, why are we seeing this again? Okay, thank God. I'm 
might wake up a motherfucker's play. <laughs> my god dude yo this per yo i'm gonna black chickas i'm gonna wake up as a slave what <laughs> was that boogie yeah that was boogie yeah man Man. Man. Oh, the cope is real. Supporters, like, why is this a thing right now? Why is this okay? Look, all right, for people who are coping that Donald Trump is going to ruin, he was, he was already, he was already president for four years. Okay, Donald Trump was already president for four years. And you think that all of a sudden he's going to come back and like make everything worse? It's just going to be better. And look, the thing is, she's saying, that, oh, I'm going to wake up tomorrow and I'm going to be a slave. Yo, that's some men freaking mental victim mentality right there, man. Holy crap. These people are insane, dude. Oh, Jesus. I can't do this no more. I should have kept my vote to myself because I knew it didn't fucking matter. I knew it didn't. Oh my God, this guy's probably gay. Look, the only people that I see that are doing these, like the fact that, why are they even filming themselves? You think this is funny? Like, the, because it is. But the thing is, like, why would you do it? What, you think you're gonna get clout for it? You think you're gonna get more followers? This is insane. This is insane. Like, I guarantee you half of these people who are on here, they don't even know, they didn't even know, like, what, who Trump was until, like, the past four years. They probably weren't even able to vote in 2016. Man, this is the first gay guy we see that's, uh... Man... And he's Asian too. He looks Asian. He looks like a Filipino. You know, like, oh, okay, why do you pop for Trump? Ah, no, bye. I want to pop for Trump. Ay, oh, yeah. Oh, no, bye. <laughs> oh, shit. That's, it's so, it's so cringe, man. Okay. This is so, I'm gonna skip the next one. I'm gonna skip the next one. From hysterically crying one minute over the pain of this situation and then hysterically crying the next minute watching so many people come together and women from our I go from hysterically crying one minute over the Okay. It's alright. Hey, out of all of them, like she might be like the most regular looking one. Okay, that, yeah, that, that, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, my Tagalog is good, yeah, yeah, just, yeah, Fil Filipino wife, yeah, that's, that, that's what, it does that to you, all right, she looks, I, I don't know how she looks like from the waist, from, from, from the boob down, she looks like she's on the chunkier side, but maybe I can, ch she might be able to be changed, I can, I might be able to fix her, she looks like she's, she, she could be pretty hot. Okay. That that's a demon. That that's a demon right there. She can't be fixed. My bad. She she, uh, she got that soccer mom bod. Oh, it doesn't matter anymore. She fucking demon. Oh, Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> oh, my God. 
Oh my god. Man. Jesus. Yeah, y'all need Jesus. <laughs> why did he do this to themselves? Why did he, why did he do this to themselves? You film yourself like oh my Oh my god Red dude. Mirage blue shift. Red Mirage blue shift. That that's coping right there. Red Mirage blue shift. Red Mirage blue shift. Red Mirage blue shift. Red Mirage blue shift. Oh my. Red Mirage blue shift. Oh. Yeah. Is that Justin Bieber? Oh, never mind. It's a woman. Not going to emotionally see, see, the thing is that you can't tell with these guys anymore. Cosmetic surgery is getting really good. <laughs> Recover from this year. Uh, what a shit show. Oh, you know what's going to send me over the edge, actually, is if I see one post where people are like, oh, make sure to hydrate and breathe and take care of yourself. <laughs> 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 you love to see it boys oh we are so back we are so back oh my god man yes yesterday was a nail biter we fucking did it it was called earlier today uh arizona we finally got arizona we might even get um carry lake i heard they, there might be stuff that's coming in for carry lake we got Nevada. Nevada has not been red since 2004. Holy crap, man. Since 2004, it hasn't been red. And then we got Pennsylvania, Michigan, Wisconsin. Ooh, and we, and we got the Senate. The only thing that we need now is the House. And oh my God, dude. Oh, but it's looking like it. It's, it's good. Oh, man. And I, I, I can't wait for Inauguration Day, dude. I, I can't wait. We're gonna get we're gonna get that freaking uh no! we're gonna we're gonna get that girl again. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But man, these people have these people are crazy, man. But yeah, uh this is a huge W. Uh we got a lot of work to do though. We gotta make sure that uh when the midterms roll around, nothing happens. But the thing I guarantee you, in the next what 80-ish days, there's gonna be a lot of people that are going to come out and try to like assassinate Trump. Like I, I've seen people on X already. Like I've seen people who are like, Oh, have you, um, you know, I, you know, I'm going to do this to him. I'm going to, and then like, I'm like, it's, it's, it's people who are absolutely insane, but you know, let's, I, I want to see more. I want to see more of these meltdowns, man. Holy crap. Yeah. Arizona was called about 20 minutes ago. You got damn right. Man, this was a red tsunami that we wanted. And the thing is that I'm glad Trump lost in 2020. Like, I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad he lost. Is because the campaign and his cabinet right now and that the people who are behind him are much better than what he had in 2020. Let's go.